Hey everyone, Dave from Corso here with our special guest. Alex from Corso. Are Let's you go. gonna pick different names of companies? No. Okay. Bill, I'm drinking my coffee. This is the strange stuff from Alex's apartment. No idea how it tastes. Hot and caffeiny. You wanna tell them what we're gonna talk about today, Alex? Today we're gonna to talk about inductive automations and modules. Yes. So, if you guys are like us, and most of the people we talk to, you look to see what inductive automations modules are, and you understand most of it, and at some point you're going to be really confused and have to call someone like Shane or us to figure out what exactly it is, and so we thought we would tell, we thought we would go through all the modules and kind of explain them one by one as a reference for anyone who asks the same questions that we do all the time. You want to tell them what we're going to do first? The vision module. Okay. What if you sit it over there? Uh, so we're going to do the vision module first. That's the basis of any inductive automation system. Cool. So there are two types of vision modules. We've got the unlimited and the limited. Uh, the only major difference is that the unlimited gives you, as it calls it, unlimited visualizations, and the limited gives you a maximum of five visualizations. And as a general rule, we would always suggest someone using inductive automation ignition go with the unlimited unless you're using it as a single client license. Right? Yep. And each client will count towards that. So if you have five clients open, then that will... Be, you can't open a sixth client at that point, but you could still open the designer and do development in your case. And because it's a basic thing, a client is literally, you're open up, opening it up and looking at a screen, right? Mm -hmm. So like your HMIs or your online dashboards or your mobile dashboards, or I assume when we get to perspective, we'll still be talking about a perspective open as a client. Yeah, we'll figure that out once we get the beta. Where's the beta? Actually, we probably have the beta by the time this video comes yeah. out. So, if we have it, thanks for the beta. And then vision includes your screens, all your graphics, alarming, trending. Uh, it will give you historical tag access and real-time data access. Uh, so basically, you could build a system to control a plan with just the vision module. You're not going to get into like alarm notifications and database access and reporting and that sort of thing with just vision. Those are additional things that you have to get on top of that. Uh, but we'll kind of cover those in more detail in future videos and also the different packages that they offer to kind of get you started. And like it won't come with the drivers or anything like that, yeah. but so can we yeah. like sum up with vision is literally the most basic thing that if you have an ignition package, you have vision? Yes. And it will give you access to um, OPC servers. Yes. And I believe the Modbus driver is part of their free package. Yeah. Uh, but then you can add like Siemens and Allen Bradley and DNP3 and different drivers beyond that um, to the vision package. But basically, I haven't seen anybody only have the vision module yet. It's the vision module plus other things, but that's yes. the, the core. That if all you had was, I want to run a couple pumps and open a couple valves and do a trend on like a treatment plant pump station or something, uh, you could get away with just that. And now I feel like we've gone to a very dark place and Alex is going to spend his weekend building something out on just vision. Maybe. I do want to see the historical data access. I think it just doesn't uh, expose it to the database like you get with a tag historian. Yes, tag historian, very important. Future video. When you watch us on YouTube, this will all be in a series if we do it properly. And luckily we know the person that puts them on YouTube. And you should just be able to continue on and read about tag historian, storm forward, all the important things. So, Dave and Alex from Corso saying, thanks for watching the video. 
Bill, we're still drink. I'm still drinking the coffee. Alex is out of coffee for today. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, tell us what you think, and let us know what you want to see next. Bye. And you could, I don't know why you would, mm -hmm. but you could do an ignition project without vision if you're using it for data access only or using their web dev module to return data to a website via like a URL or a browser. I wouldn't do that myself. Okay. But so. you technically could you do an ignition project without vision if for certain use cases. Alex, can I be super serious? I think we need to stop this and try this again because I think we went completely off the rails at some point. No, Around just, the point in time where you were telling people that they could do it without vision after we just told people they all have vision. But you could also do uh, just the mobile module or with perspective, you could have perspective be your vision client access. But do you get a designer with mobile? I thought you only get the designer with vision because you also get symbol factory with vision. Well, maybe we shouldn't have said it on the video then. So, so are we just editing off at that I point? I would leave it in because you actually could do screens and, or not do screens, but you could do data uh, APIs and stuff. Okay, but didn't we just confuse? No, we just added information for anybody that watched this far. Okay. <laughs> so if you watched this far, it will obviously be after the strange break where we said, thanks for watching, tune in next time. But like, comment or that could be a blooper email us. Oh no, this is definitely on the bloopers. <laughs> Do you guys like our bloopers? Okay. Bye, thanks for watching. So now we're going to do the end, okay. where we ask them to like, comment, and subscribe, okay. and tell us what they want to see next. Okay. And we're going to cut this part in before that strange four-minute okay. vision conversation we had. Okay.